Yo, it's your boy DJ and welcome to Beautiful Faces back to Uncharted 4. This is part, um, ooh, part 10. <laughs> Got it right, let's go. Wait, no, this is part 11. Oh, man. <laughs> Darn. Okay, I messed it up anyway. I'll try it. Alright, so, um, this is not the same day. I'm wearing the same jacket, but this is a whole different day. And I had to re-record this, so I already know what happens. So we're gonna try and fly through this as quickly as possible. Hey, groom. I think I went this way before, right? Yeah. And I saw that he was cooking up all these chickens and these ribs and pork chops and stuff like that. He whipping up. I think that's like a cabbage, like something. I don't know what that is though. No, thanks. But okay, fine, fine. Best apples Here. in the market. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Enjoy your apple and tell your friends. Gotta support the local businesses, you know? Local black business. Hey there, little guy. How you doing? Hey, you like that? Huh? Power. It's a solid. Come on, it's a, it's a lemur. Come on, come say hi. That's all right. <laughs> so cute. I'm watching you, lemur. I knew he was gonna do that, bro. Hey! Hey, Sully! Hey! He stole my apple! Can't trust anyone these days. Apple's right here. Nah, no, I stepped on it, so. He stole the apple and dropped it. Hey, you know what? After this is over and done with, I'm gonna get a dog. Hey, if we come out of this in one piece, I'll buy you the damn dog. Can I name it Victor? <laughs> Hey, Nate, want me to buy you one of these? Sully, you gotta be crazy to wear a shirt like that. Ah, crazy handsome. <laughs> Got the same exact shirt here. Oh, man. If you say not beginning of the game, you know they, they um, they used to, um, they used to places like this. Mm, that's right. It does smell good. It's amazing. Excuse me. Is there anything I missed? I'm not seeing it. I don't think so. Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. So. Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. Long way down. <sighs> you okay back there? You keep your pace. <clears throat> I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? <clears throat> Enter this window. <clears throat> okay, let's see what we got. Edward England sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. Oh yeah, I'm playing with um, the other controller. So it's going to be a little bit jittery when I walk. This is a very tall clock tower. Yes. Yes, it is.
Hmm. Now what do you bet? some bells. This is definitely the place. Call Sam. On it. Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus. Voicemail. Hey, Sam. Looks like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. <laughs> Climb up. I'll be right back. Should be relatively easy this time. Shouldn't be okay. oh, too hard. I'll be damned. Check it out, Sully. The clock still works. Yeah, I noticed. Try not to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Time. Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, and Taurus. So Scorpio, I don't remember exactly where it is. Right here, there we go. Nate can jump off. Scorpio. That Avery was a Scorpio. Quay is next, right? So it's down there. Aquarius? Always oh, nice people. This is not the hard part of the puzzles I did for the video. I can't wait to get to the hard part because hopefully I can just get through it quickly, but it might take me a few minutes. Oh, we can't climb right. What am I doing? Nice. Phone. 
Leo. I dated a Leo once. Sometimes it takes forever to climb, or it takes forever for him to move. Took about 12 minutes. Well, that part took 12 minutes. Thank you for the free stairs, by the way. Gotta wait until you finish this writing this journal all the way. Yep. Let's go. Are way too fast, so we're gonna go this way. It's time, this time, this time. Move. Scare myself. All right, wasted a bullet and scared myself. Wow, this is a nice view. No, 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 no. Jesus. Can we just grab it? There we go. Nice. Love how everything breaks. My grab onto it. Oh, that's about to break too. Oh, there you are. Okay, Sully, I made it. Hey. <sighs> Final part to this part. Swing.
Jesus Christ. I expected that and it still scared me. Nice. <laughs> nice. Hey Sally. Oh shit. At least I got the door open though, huh? <laughs> That's one way to do it. You alright? I don't know yet. You? Jeff? Hi. Sure, why not? Let's see what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally, you okay? Just search my towel, I, I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. I'll be quick. Oh man. Now this is the long part that took me forever to do this. Sully. Way ahead of you. Whoa. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah. They got those star patterns on them. I wrote they turn. But which way are they supposed to go? Whoa. Okay. Should we go look? Yeah, d just a second. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out just while even doing it. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I wanna see something. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. He said there's too many permutations, no one's about to figure it out, that's why. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. I was about to figure it out, that's why they just stopped me. <laughs> Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condon. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. No. I well, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. Hey, look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Condon went by Billy One Hand. Guess he had one made. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, I'm not just a pretty face. Huh. Bonnie was a redhead. Yeah. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? I bet these line up, too. Hmm. Alright, so I do know, put this down, I do know this one's supposed to be this way, so pick it up, boom, and boom, then, yeah, so I almost had it, that's why he stopped me, <laughs> it's supposed to, that's how it's supposed to be part of the story, that's why they stopped me. Yep. Oh. Add another doorway. Yeah. So, who are these guys? That's, um, they are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? 
close. Text a brother. All right. So after he gets off the phone, text him. There. And wipe his journal. Can I try it out? Can't even try it out. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. William Mays. American? Yeah, from Rhode Island. Just like Thomas, too. Here we go. <laughs> Should be able to fly through this relatively quickly. Check your phone. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Warren, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. But Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet. But I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Books, globe. This Want guy looks like a scholar. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. <laughs> uh, that, that wig is huge. They used to wear huge hand. wigs. You got it. Those wigs are crazy. Thanks. You ever seen an um, episode of SpongeBob where they had to wear those big wigs? It just reminded me of that. That was funny. <laughs> those wigs are gigantic. Well, I care. And of course, they can get pretty dirty if you don't, you know, clean them. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. It's a good thing I remember it was right there. All right, on to the next one. Oh, wait, I didn't even organize them for you guys. Hold up. Let me just flip this one, I think. Uh, I think it was this way, actually. Let me just check. All right, so inspect. I think this one is supposed to be this way. Picks up. And I think that's it. Yeah, it's supposed to be downward. I don't think that's lined up though. That doesn't look lined up. Hmm. Let's try it out, cause maybe the pages aren't lined up. Let's try it out though. Yeah, that's not lined up. Hold on, give me a second. There we go. Yeah, that's lined up. So it's supposed to, yeah, the black dolphin's supposed to be on the side, the right side facing towards the tribe. <laughs> Here. Uh, you know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful, that's all. Uh huh, of course. This last part always took the longest. That should be able to do it a little bit quicker. What happened here? A torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger. Symbols right there, I see it already. It's faced at an angle, so it's on his arm. Or near his left arm. Which is alright. Oh, Sam texted me back. Now, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Gloating is unseemly. Yeah, I know. Let's just look at the paintings. Edward England, Sarik Ben Malik, Yazard. Albasar, Baz, Basra, and the monkey symbol he's never seen before. Huh. No name. This guy's get up looks Moorish. I think that's a leopard on his shoulder. Huh. 
Yazid al Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, not the muggles, the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. And Edward this one. Edwin. Stout little fellow. He's on his satchel. Did it pretty quickly, actually. Huh. It didn't take as long. Let's go. So now we have to figure out which one right, was which. Got the names of two uh, of you should still be able to figure this out. I don't recall which one was which. I think it just put them like right here. I think it switched this one. So put this one right here. And put this right here. And let's try to match it up. Well, that's not perfect, but let's try and match it up this way. There we go. Then turn the tiger to the right, and these are lined up. So the monkey's upside down. The other symbol right next to the England one is to the left. That's upside down, and then the tiger's to the left. So this is upside down. Monkey's upside down. This is turned to the left. And this one is supposed to be turned towards it. What do we got? Uh, not sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just saying. Okay, that's that one. Relatively easily. It didn't take me long at all. You know, it took me about an hour to do that before. And it's basically like half an hour for this entire video. And two? It's crazy. Last one. <laughs> Took me like pretty much over an hour to do everything. Alright, let's see what he makes of them. You know, that kind of looks huh. like. What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Here, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh, all right. These could be trade winds. Yeah, and these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, boy. What? Prodeus cod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, so obvious. Nate. Oh, why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? <laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. It's been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner, well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow, Rafe Adler, taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. And I'm willing to forgive and forget, for old times' sake. As tempting as that sounds, Rafe, I gotta say, I'm... Not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quo licentia. Forgotten liberty. These are nice pictures, Nate. Good composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I really gotta take this call, so... Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? 
I'll see you soon, buddy. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now. And destroy your phone. What's going on? Rafe knows where we are. Right, we gotta find some place to hide. Oh, shit. Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey! I'll buy you a new one. All right, y'all. This is where we left off last time. I'm gonna end it here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Things are getting very heated up. Sam is in a tough situation, as I was hoping to not have to do this, but most likely, of course, with Drake, it had to happen. So, yeah. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you already haven't. Make sure to share the video as much as possible. Really upside the channel. Make sure you turn notifications on so next I post the video. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, and Twitter, all right here. Also in the description. And yeah. See you next video. See you next time, of course. We should see one of you. Peace. Bang.